Welcome back to my channel. We are headed to the thrift store today. We're hunting for spring fashion trends. I recently put together a list of all of my favorite trends for this season, specifically geared towards busty women like myself. And now it's time to put them to the test. So I'm headed to a local thrift store here in Los Angeles to see what we can find. By the way, if you're new here, hey, I'm Alex. I'm a digital nomad, splitting my time between LA, Italy, Mexico, and other amazing parts of the world. And I love sharing fashion, lifestyle, and wellness videos on this channel so if that sounds interesting to you hit the subscribe button down below it really helps my channel grow and it helps me bring more videos to you all each and every week let's go oh my gosh look at this leopard print coat it's not branded it's, i found two blue blazers icy blue is really in season this is a vintage one and this is from Shein. I have something like this at home already though, so I probably won't take it. They're both $15. Oh my god, this is amazing. This looks exactly like an oversized denim shirt that I pinned on my Pinterest board. It's like the same shade of blue. It's from a brand called Eve Denim and it's $15. I also found this. This is not necessarily... Well, it is the leather trend actually. This is a new with tags. Max Studio jacket. It was $98. Okay, I quickly just came to the shoe section and I found these red knee-high boots. They're kind of cool. I don't love the heel, but it has like a really fun accent. I think they could be nice. I'm gonna try them on. And they're $17.99. $17 that feels a little overpriced. I also just saw this Technic, like purple isn't one of the accent colors of the season, but it's a pastel. I feel like these always work for spring and it's the animal print trend which you know I love an animal print bag so I'm actually very into this very cute then I also I found this set which is again more animal print I'm being very maximalist today this is from honey punch it's so cute it's like a skirt and jacket but I think it might be a little small it's also $24.99. This good was kind of overpriced. But, and then I also found this super cute Topshop denim dress. This is a perfect spring trend. We'll see if this fits too though. $10.99. This, this is so cute. I don't know if it'll fit, but look at this adorable red dress from French. $8.99. It's like a very classic, almost European style dress. And then I found a bunch of bottoms. I'm not sure about these. They might be a little too short short, but found some great high-waisted shorts. These are from Zara. They're kind of like a lightweight, almost, I don't know what kind of fabric this is, but they're almost pleated here at the top. These are $7.99. I found this really cute plaid one from Wear Society Leather Skirt from a brand called One Way. This is $9.99. I found this bodycon dress, which is from, oh, it's from Forever 21. Floral bodycon dress, definitely scream it spring. I also found these Zara jeans that are great for the denim trend. I think they should fit. I'm really liking them. I kind of wish it didn't have this giant hole at the knee, but then I also found this dress. This is a baby corset top dress. I'm looking for some oversized denim jeans. I found these ones have some potential. $7.99. These are 501 Levi's. They're definitely very oversized, so I need to go try them on and see if it's too much or the right amount. Oh my gosh, you guys. I talked about fruit pattern and fruit knitwear in my trends video, and look at this. Need a manager for an exchange? Oh, this is so cute. This is an icy blue jacket from H&M. So $6.99. Thank you. I'm scoring with the jacket. All right, we are back home and I have a big haul of stuff to show you all. Definitely had a great time at the thrift store finding some really fun spring pieces. So let's jump right into the haul. So the first piece you all probably guessed, you saw how excited I was when I saw it in the store. It's this beautiful denim 
kind of longer sh denim shirt. This is from a brand called Eve Denim, and it's just the perfect, perfect spring 2024 piece. It's this darker blue wash denim. It covers, it's kind of like a longer length covering a little bit of the booty. It's got pockets. It's in excellent condition. It doesn't have any rips or stains. It's a little bit thicker as a denim, so it definitely works as like an outerwear jacket piece. It's just perfect like literally ripped right out of my pinterest board i'm so excited to style this up and truthfully have already worn this a little bit i can't remember now how much it was because i took the tag off already anyway so excited for this piece next i'll go into bottoms i picked up this really fun leopard print mini skirt this is originally from princess polly and it's kind of this satin material it's very soft it's got like kind of a flower print beneath the leopard print if you can see that it's very subtle but really fun this is a perfect piece for my upcoming Miami trip. So I'm definitely gonna be incorporating this into some fun vacation outfits soon. And this was originally $5.99, y'all. Such a steal. This is such an amazing piece. Perfect for spring, on trend with the animal print, and definitely gonna carry me into some fun summer and vacation outfits as well. Next for bottoms, I really lucked out with this pair of Levi's jeans. These are 501 Levi's jeans. They are buttoned down the front. They are a light wash jean and they're kind of straight leg with a distressed bottom. These are awesome. They're a little oversized, which I don't mind at all. Going to be wearing these definitely with a belt and they just, they kind of give that like relaxed boyfriend look almost. And I kind of wanted to pick up something that was a little sloucher, a little more relaxed, which is more in line with this spring's trends. So great essential piece. This was $14.99. Next, I picked up this really sweet red flower print dress. I absolutely love this bodice. It's got a bit of a deep V. It's really fitted at the waist and it has kind of like a, somewhere between like a straight and an A line. It's got long sleeves. It's just a really beautiful, elegant dress. And it's that pop of red that I'm looking for this season. This is from a brand called French. And it's a zipper down the back. It's got a few little button details in the front here. Just super elegant and precious. And this was $8.99. All right, I picked up two more pieces. It is in line with the leather trend for spring. But this is brown leather jacket, new with tags from Max Studio. It's definitely like a slouchy moto jacket. It's a vegan leather. Definitely gives almost like a 90s, 90s grunge look. Again, leather is really in style for spring, so I could absolutely be wearing this now. It would also work really well in the fall, obviously. What do you think about this? I'm kind of on the fence. I like it. I don't know that I love it, but it was new with tags, so I figured... I should give it a shot, but let me know if you think I should keep it or go back and exchange it. This was $19.99. So on the pricier end for something at the thrift store, but it was new with tags. So leave me a comment down below. What do you think? Do you like it? Should I keep it? Should I go back and get something different? Let me know. And then the last piece is a little accessory for my upcoming Miami trip. I found this really cute, woven bucket hat how freaking cute is this this is originally from h&m and it is just i think the perfect vacation piece i don't love myself in hats to be honest but like i will absolutely need a hat for miami it's kind of creased i, think I need to like put it under a book or something to get the creases out but what do we think about this is she like a cute little bucket hat girly for Miami, I think this could be fun. I feel like I need some sunglasses to complete the look. Hold please. All right, what do we think? I feel like it has potential, but with the creases, it's like kind of giving Gandalf. <laughs> Gandalf the gray. All right, it has potential. I'll see if I can get the creases out and make it work. 
but I just, I saw these a lot last summer. I just thought they were so fun. Leave me a comment down below. What do you think? Does she work or no? All right, that is everything for today's spring Pinterest haul. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to hit the subscribe button down below so you don't miss any new videos from me. I post new videos every single week. So until next time, bye. Thank you.